Over a million of us took part in last year's RSPB Big Garden Bird Watch. It's the biggest wildlife survey in the world and taking part is easy. Get a cup of tea, biscuit or cake. Um, and then just sit and enjoy your garden and see what you can see. If you don't have a garden, maybe you could do the similar thing in your local park or local green space. In Kate's garden, you might see anything from woodpeckers to long-tailed tits. Oh. Who knows what might turn up in your garden, balcony or park. And when you've finished your hour-long bird watch in your own garden or green space and uploaded the results to the RSPB website, well, then you can tune into the RSPB's YouTube channel all weekend, where they'll have a live feed from feeders and birds right around the country and also live chat with experts like Kate and Chris Packham. This survey provides some really important information, allowing us to see how our wild bird populations are doing. But it's also a chance to make a bit of space in your life for some wildlife, something many of us have really come to appreciate over the past two years. Since lockdown and with all the events that have happened in the last year, I think people have really come to appreciate their own spaces and their own gardens and what they can do for wildlife there. And there's nothing more wonderful than sitting down with a cup of tea and watching your garden birds. So this Friday, Saturday or Sunday, pick an hour and spend it watching and counting the birds. Debbie Gregory Kumar, BBC Midlands Today, Litchfield.